What's up everyone? And we are here at the Electrify Expo. We are excited to go talk to some brands about the bikes that they have, what they have coming up in the future, and of course, test ride some bikes on the go-kart track. Hey guys, we are with Chris at Zoos Bikes. This doesn't look like your average e-bike, and I'm into it. Kind of reminds me of a BMX bike I had growing up. What's going on here? Basically, we wanted to build something that we wanted to ride. It had to go fast, stop fast, turn fast, and look good while you were doing it. So we basically designed bikes that are built for speed and style. Cool. And this is basically what we ended up with. We started dabbling, or I started dabbling in 2018, and then a friend of mine saw what I was doing, and he had a lot of consumer product and electronic uh, brand experience, and we kind of joined forces, and then we layered another guy in and another guy in, and yeah, we're yeah. kind of like a jazz band. We fit together really nicely, and we're just trying to take our product, our brand, to the next level. And so this is the 2023 model. It's basically the same setup, the same geometry. All the magic is baked in there, and that's never going to change. But this year, we've added a few things. A stem headlight that yeah. we haven't really seen on the market before. It's hidden in there real nice. Uh, we added a racking system. And so when the racks aren't on there, it doesn't really disrupt anything. But then when the racks are there, it doesn't disrupt the beautiful lines of the bike. Yeah. It's wildly functional. Um, we basically chose our favorite third-party accessories that you could fit directly onto the racks and run them all at the same time as well. Cool. Now, the third-party accessory space is massive, and so you can really kit it out exactly how you want, but we, like I said, chose some of our favorite ones. We got a Fairdale skate rack, it goes directly on there. We have a Chrome Industries pannier bag, goes directly on there. Cool. Uh, bike case, their Dairyman product is okay. kind of like the, it's a nicer version of a uh, milk crate, mm -hmm. and you can, they have a quick release one, so that'll go cool. on here. They also do a rubber strap mount. You can go front and rear. Yeah. Um, you know, we wanted to make it a little bit more versatile. This is the Ultra Urban. It's really like an urban-focused product. Everything you need, nothing you don't. And again, we wanted to take the next step with it where people can not only have fun with it, but really use it, especially yeah. as we're seeing this shift in how people are getting around, especially in a smaller area, whether you call that last mile or personal transportation yeah. you know we we want to ride how we want to ride yeah. and so we're just trying to get further on down the road and sure. make it cool make it useful and so this is what we've ended up with this is basically our flagship product we have essentially one model with originally three different drivetrains okay we got rid of the 250 focusing on the 750 and the 1100 cool and uh, we have a new product coming out soon. That's gonna be pretty exciting. Sweet. Um, I can't say too much about that now, but yeah, it's, it's hush. bigger, better, <laughs> badder. Awesome. And uh, yeah, we're stoked yeah. to be here. Yeah, we're, uh, we're in Oregon, so we've uh, seen a few cruising around and a little lively entertainment there. So yeah, yeah. they're definitely cool bikes and uh, we're excited to get out on the track and finally get our leg over one. They rip, man. Yeah. All right, we've stopped at Zen Electric Bikes and talking with Nicole, who's gonna give us a little overview of these cool looking electric bikes. Hey everyone. Uh, yeah, so we're North American made, hand assembled in Dartmouth, Nova Scotia. We have an integrated Bosch drive system with a carbon fiber belt drive and internal gear hub. This bike is extremely low maintenance and high performance. So do you have anything cool coming in 2023? Yeah, for sure. Our CEO is a battery scientist and he's bringing to market a long life e-bike battery. That's awesome. I mean, you just want stuff to last longer so you can ride it more. Exactly, and less resources being wasted. Cool. Well, we are excited to get on some of these bikes and ride around the test course and hopefully in some sunny weather. Perfect, yeah, can't wait for it. All right, thanks. Hey guys, we're here with Troy from Specialized. Got a bunch of super rad bikes here. I'm gonna let him kind of share a little bit about what they have in their lineup. If you haven't seen their bikes, they're a blaster ride and they're built very well. Hey everybody, thanks for checking us out. So today we're here at Electrify Expo in Austin and uh, what we're really bringing to the table here is all of our active bikes. Um, we're really trying to focus on that lineup. We have our Comos and Vados 
and we have two main motor packages that are in those. Um, we have a full power motor and then also our SL motor, which is our lightweight motor. And we're really trying to highlight those two categories here. Um, the lightweight motor is just gonna be for someone who's just looking for a little bit of assist, but also wants the electrified lifestyle and yeah. getting around. So. We have here um, our Como SL, and that's basically gonna amplify whatever you are putting in it as a rider, um, 200%, and then our full power motors are amplifying your output times 400%. Um, so we have Vado in that category, and we have Como in that category, and they both have their smaller motor package, Vado SL and Como SL. Cool. Anything new in the pipeline beyond this, or are we keeping it kind of hush-hush for now? Yeah, we kind of have been throwing out some, some teasers here um, about our, our Globe brand, so definitely check out our website, Specialized.com, and we're continuing to throw some stuff out there, and uh, we're listening to the riders, and our big focus is identifying a rider and uh, making a bike specifically for their needs. We are halfway through our day at Electrify Expo and it is just buzzing with people. You hear electric motors go all over the place. We are above the test track and we are excited to go ride as many bikes as we can. We've got Barney with Bulls here, and he's gonna tell us a little bit about Bulls and what they have going on. Hey everyone, I'm Barney. Hey, we've got the new smart system coming in uh, for model year 23. So behind me, I've got the iconic Evo TR1 750. It's got the largest capacity battery from Bosch, 750 watt hours, uh, super torquey motor at 85 newton meters peak torque. Uh, just be able to rip it. We've got everything from uh, e-trekking style bikes all the way up to your uh, full suspension mountain bikes as well. Awesome. And like, what's been your most popular then? I, I'm, I want to try to ride one of your gravel bikes, yeah, but you, what about like you got You got to try the Desert Falcon Evo in, uh, in the demo booth. Uh, uh, the, the full suspension lineup uh, for the e-trekking side has been really popular. And then uh, our wave uh, style mountain bikes are really popular as well. Awesome. Well, I think we're gonna go hop on over and throw our legs over bike and pedal around the test course. Hey guys, I am with Mindy from Flyer. They've got some pretty rad bikes and we've all seen the radio flyers of the past. These look a little bit different. What's up? Yeah, so Radio Flyer officially has e-bikes. We launched our first line of e-bikes last year. Radio Flyer, of course, has been around for over 100 years. We've been making products to haul kids in cargo, and we really see this as the next evolution of that. So all of our e-bikes are designed for families. Um, all, they all have different kid and cargo hauling accessories. Yeah, I'm wondering, so this one's got a little basket on the back. Mm -hmm. Is that the same dimensions as the the little pull line trailer? It's a little, a little different little dimensions, okay. but it definitely serves the same purpose. So this is our Flyer L885 long tail cargo bike. That's our kid and cargo carrier accessory on the back. Right now it's in kid mode. You can zip up the yeah. size in cargo mode. Oh, fun. Yeah. Awesome. Well, anything new coming out beyond <laughs> this? Or, I mean, obviously, relatively fresh, so this is the new stuff. Absolutely, so the biggest new thing that we're doing here at the Electrify Expo is that blue bike behind me. Okay. That's our new cruiser bike. Just launched it yesterday. Oh. Comes in a few different colors. It has that really nice classic cruiser style feel, um, but also just with the boost of an e-bike, it's kind of the yeah. best pairing. Awesome. So that's the newest and latest. We, of course, we're always innovating at Radio yeah, Flyer, yeah. so we have a lot of things coming in the pipeline for 2023. Awesome. So definitely check us out on our website or our socials to learn more. We'll be excited to get a leg over one of those soon. Yeah, so these ones are super fun. I know what we've been hearing a lot from families is it's great for taking kids to and from school and then going to the grocery store yeah. right after. We've been getting a lot of really good feedback. This is definitely our top seller right now. Awesome, great. Well, cool. Well, thank you very much. Yes, thank yeah. you. It's a pleasure meeting you. All right, we got Jason with Jackrabbit Bikes and these are tiny light bikes, and he's gonna give us a little overview of these. Yeah, so this is Jackrabbit, uh, best micro e-bike by several different reviewers, and, and uh, um, we got a bunch of riders all over the country now. It's a 300 watt motor, 
20 miles an hour, 24 pounds, folds up. This is it folded over here. Um, it also, it's the only e-bike you can fly with, you know, as well. So throw it in a travel bag, throw it in the trunk of your car, uh, gets 10 plus miles range, super fun to ride, super useful. Yeah, I mean, he, he has the record for holding it up. I think he'll beat me, but <laughs> you can carry this up any amount of stairs. Yeah, and it just great for boats, RVs, small apartments, but just great for everything. Never worry about parking again on a ride is what we like to say as well. But big, big stable wheels, 20 inch wheels, um, zippy, super smooth ride, super maneuverable. We encourage folks to jump on a Jackrabbit, try it out, you know, see for yourself. Awesome. Well, we're going to go on the course and hop on and ride around. But... Yeah, they're, they're a thousand bucks as well. So, you know, we want to, everyone should have a Jackrabbit. We price them this way, you know, so that, uh, so to get them out there. And uh, yeah, they're super fun. Sweet. Definitely try it. Awesome. Yeah. Thank you very much. All right, well, it's been an absolute blast being down here at the Electrify Expo. There are so many bikes and people just cruising around on this track. We've had a blast riding everything so far. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if an Electrify Expo is coming to you, you gotta be sure to go check it out because it's definitely worth the experience to go ride a bunch of bikes. And hey, who knows? Maybe you'll be going home with one. Thanks for watching and we'll see you at the next Expo.